Hello friends. In this video we will discuss the most important expected questions which may be asked in the exam of Surveyor Civil Engineer Post, exam taken by Gujarat Subordinate Service Selection Board, exam will be taken on the 1st of April 2018. Welcome to our channel. Civil Engineering Basics. For more videos please subscribe, Civil Engineering Basics. When the angular measurements of a traverse are more precise than the linear measurements, the balancing of a traverse is done by transit rule. When the angular measurements of a traverse are more precise than the linear measurements, the balancing of a traverse is done by transit rule. A line normal to the plumb line at all points is known as level line. A line normal to the plumb line at all points is known as level line. A line normal to the plumb line at all points is known as level line. A fixed point of reference of known elevation is called benchmark. A fixed point of reference of known elevation is called benchmark. A fixed point of reference of known elevation is called benchmark. The method of surveying used for determining the relative height of points on the surface of the earth is called leveling. The method of surveying used for determining the relative height of points on the surface of the earth is called leveling. The vertical distance above or below the datum is called reduced level of the point or elevation of the point. The vertical distance above or below the datum is called reduced level of the point or elevation of the point. A staff reading taken on a benchmark or a point of known elevation is called backside reading. A staff reading taken on a benchmark or a point of known elevation is called backside reading. A backsight indicates the setting up of the instrument. A backsight indicates the setting up of the instrument. A backsight indicates the setting up of the instrument. An arbitrary surface with reference to which the elevation of points are measured and compared, is called datum surface. An arbitrary surface with reference to which the elevation of points are measured and compared, is called datum surface. The line of collimation should be horizontal when staff readings are being taken. The line of collimation should be horizontal when staff readings are being taken.
To find the true difference of level between two points, the level should be kept exactly midway between the two points. To find the true difference of level between two points, the level should be kept exactly midway between the two points. The reduced level of the plane of collimation is equal to height of instrument. The reduced level of the plane of collimation is equal to height of instrument. The reduced level of the plane of collimation is equal to height of instrument. The height of instrument is equal to reduced level of benchmark plus back sight. The height of instrument is equal to reduced level of benchmark plus back sight. The height of instrument is equal to reduced level of benchmark plus back sight. Horizontal distance obtained tachyometrically are corrected for refraction and curvature correction. Horizontal distance obtained tachyometrically are corrected for refraction and curvature correction. The most reliable method of plotting a theodolite traverse, is by independent coordinates of each station. The most reliable method of plotting a theodolite traverse, is by independent coordinates of each station. One of the tachometric constants is additive, the other constant is multiplying constant. One of the tachometric constants is additive, the other constant is multiplying constant. Setting out a curve by two theodolite method involves angular measurements only. Setting out a curve by two theodolite method involves angular measurements only. A method of differential leveling is used in order to find the difference in elevation between two pints when they are too far apart. There are obstacles between them. The difference in elevation between them is too great. A method of differential leveling is used in order to find the difference in elevation between two pints when they are too far apart. There are obstacles between them. The difference in elevation between them is too great. The collimation method for obtaining the reduced bearing of points does not provide check on intermediate sites. The collimation method for obtaining the reduced bearing of points does not provide check on intermediate sites. The rise and fall method for obtaining the reduced levels of pints provides a check on foresight, backsight, and intermediate sites also. The rise and fall method for obtaining the reduced levels of pints provides a check on foresight, backsight, and intermediate sites also.
the point on which the instrument is set up, is called station point is not true at all. The point on which the instrument is set up, is called station point is false. Thank you so much for viewing this video. For more video on civil engineering subscribe my channel. Civil Engineering Basics